What's up, Abe Lincoln? Up is a two-letter word that indicates direction. Hmm. <laughs> How many times have you told that joke in your life? Yeah. And that's probably conservative. Josh! <laughs> Back to our stupid rag to dance up court. One, two, three, four, five. When you can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more content, thanks to our Patreon. Grammar stuff. Bang! Follow us on Instagram. Diaper rash. Testicles. Gotta love those. Gotta be gentle with those. <laughs> There's the greatest moment in Will and Grace history. Have you seen the new Will and Grace, the one that started in 2018? I've only, I only saw the first season. Oh. I think. So you saw the moment with okay. Alec Baldwin and Karen. Oh, no, I didn't get to Alec Baldwin. Oh, my. There's a spectacular moment with Alec Baldwin and Karen where the, he's saying, we, until you agree to be with me and leave Stan, I'm not going to be physical with you. And she says, you mean you're not going to do this? And he says, yeah, and I'm not going to do this. And they mime these actions. That's why this, you reminded me of it with this. It's spectacular. Today we're doing a trailer. I believe it's a Hindi trailer. It's called Sanam Kiri. Kasam. I believe it came out in 2015, this film. Okay. Uh, it's a musical tale of love, longing, and loss. Three L's. Nice alliteration. Uh, directed by Radhika Rao and Vinay Sapru. Cast is uh, Hashavardhan Ra uh, Rain uh -huh. and Maura Hokan. I don't recognize them. Um, but that is all I know. And you said it's Hindi? It's Hindi. Okay. So I think a lot of people said this is like an underrated gem. I love that. Uh, uh, so it wasn't like one a, of those that you wouldn't necessarily hear about, but you yeah. really need to see. You guys can let us know if that's correct. Like uh, the lighthouse. Yeah, but I think that one's more independent. I think this one. This was like mainstream. More release. like mainstream, but it's like it wasn't like uh, Ramlila popular. Got it. Uh, I think you guys can tell me if I'm wrong in that assumption. Here we go. JJ. Love the tats. Yes, it was a real or one thing, it's a look, Marjate. Where should we take the money? It's a link, you would take a super crush to you. Gorgeous voice. Sorry, sorry. I'm very sorry. Why was he getting naked with a bear? Coffee. <laughs> Coffee name. Why wouldn't you? I would take you. Come back here, though. 
Never. I love you to the square of infinity. Salam teri qasam. Yeah, I liked parts of it, and there were other parts that, that were concerning to me. Me too. In terms of, would I like it? Me too. Uh, <laughs> like there were part, I, one, I think they are giving a little too much away about the entire story of this, as opposed to just being more subtle uh, with, uh, which I, I feel like sometimes the Hindi industry will do that. Mm -hmm. uh, I think they even did it with Mimi, even though we loved Mimi. I think they might have even given away a little too much in the, uh, in the in, trailer, in the trailer yeah. even though there are stuff. If you haven't seen Mimi, please go watch Mimi. Please watch Mimi. Mimi. It's fantastic. Fantastic film. Um, but I feel like sometimes, they, like as opposed to Malayalam, which is <laughs> almost very vague. Ten, ten, <laughs> tends to be like, yeah, really? What's that even about? <laughs> yeah. um, but I, there were parts of it that I was like, oh, that, that looks like a really intriguing love story. I agree. Uh, it, which, it pulled me in and pushed me out like yeah, eight times. A couple times. Yeah. <laughs> um, so I don't know. You can let us know how these actors are if they're, because that, that was one of my concerns, just mostly him sometimes. Yeah, there was an affectation that I wonder about that I don't think was a stylization of the whole thing like you'd find in, say, SRK and the Shwarya's Dead Dots, yeah. right? Um, but I agree. There were moments where I felt compelled and then other moments where I thought, mm, this feels contrived. Yeah. So there was that combination, I'm compelled, ooh, that's contrived. Ooh, it's yeah. compelling, oh, that's contrived. So again, we never ever will judge a, a, a film by its trailer. And if you guys jump up and down and say, please watch this, this is a yeah. really good film, we absolutely would. We do love a good rom-com, right? Yeah, and that's, you know me. Yeah. Musicals and rom-coms. Those are my two top favorite things to watch over. And so if I'm gonna, if I'm gonna get pushed away from a rom-com, it's gonna have to really try hard. Also, is this like a remake of a remake? It looks oh like my. There's like a, an original one in 1982. Then there's one in 19, uh, 2009. Well, and they could also just be the same title because we've seen that too. Yeah. Uh, she looked good. I actually thought she looked uh, the best in this. And um, she, v, do you see Vijay Ross. VJ Ross is a parent. <laughs> Is this one of the ones we got? What was this called? What's this film called? Wait, is that one of the ones we got in the box? Uh, what is it called? Sanam. Sanam Teri Kasam. Sorry. No, they are. No, it's not that no, one. Sanam. No, it's not that one. Okay, no, it's not. Okay, just making sure. Um, apparently, VJ Ross is in it. Whatever. Uh, dude, I, he better not have been on the trailer. I swear, we missed him. Ah! That would suck. That would suck. Um. Sorry, I'm just trying to see if there's anybody else in it. So yeah, you guys are gonna have to let us know. Uh, we do love rom-coms. What should be like the, one of the next rom? I, I know Shah Rukh Khan would technically be like rom-com, but outside of Shah Rukh Khan's rom-coms, what should we watch? Because he is his own category. Right. I feel. Yes. <laughs> um, I do. We did get after the Mimi review, jumping up and down about um, um, a film that she's in that we've reacted to the trailer. I think it has Rajkumar Rao, Pankaj, and her. And Creedy Sonnen. And Creedy. Um, a lot of people were really jumping up and down for us to uh, watch it. It's, it's a rom-com uh, with Pankaj. I'll see anything she's in now after her turn in, in Mimi. I was this. really, really impressed with her. This right here. Oh yes, I yeah. We saw the trailer to yes, that. Yes, we've seen the trailer uh, to this film. Apparently a lot of people uh, really, really enjoyed this film. Um, Bareliki Barfi. Yeah, it's with Ayushman, uh, Creedy, Raj Kumar, and Pankaj. Wow. Uh, so quite a cast. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's got Ayushman, Raj Kumar, Creedy. Is she a supporting role, a leading role? It looks like she's the main yeah, girl. Yeah, she looks like she's the main she's girl. She's probably the love okay. interest. Okay. Oh man. Let's see. With, with Pankaj and Raj Kumar. That's her, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So you guys tell us if that's a if and you, you said an Ayushman. Yeah, Ayushman's the lead. Good it? grief. Yeah. So uh, what should be the next like rom com? I know people were jumping up and down about the 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 Bar Run Keep Arfi one, uh, but let us know about the the one that we just watched from the trailer. And, and look at that one sixteen runtime. Come on, hour. It's not it's not even two hours. Not it's even just two. under two hours. 
Lately, we've been watching a lot of really long films. <laughs> <laughs> like when we first got started. Yeah. yeah. Um, so it's whenever something's like really short like that, like I watched Corello, which I was like 90 minutes. Yeah. Like this, what did I recently I mean, watch? Hollywood films fly by now. Oh my goodness. They feel it's like, really? That was the end of it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. They fly. Anyways, let us know what the next uh, rom-com should be down below. Just